Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today is May 10th, 2022. It's been about five or six months since I last uploaded a video. And in this video, I'm just going to chat with you guys, kind of explain what's going on, where I've been, why am I so inconsistent, and update you guys while I get ready for the day. It is currently 12 o'clock. Um, both of my kids are taking their naps and I usually rest during this time or pick up around the house. But today I thought would be the perfect day to hopefully start up with my videos once again. Just to kind of give you guys a recap. Um, first of all, if you are new, welcome to my channel. My name is Monica. I am a mom of two children. Um, I have a 21 month old and an almost one month old. Um, and so I kind of want to just let you guys know where I've been, what's been going on. The last video I uploaded was about six months ago. And the reason being is so if you know me, um, you know, I just, I have a love for videography, um, documenting memories and editing, honestly. And that's not the reason I'm inconsistent on YouTube. I can I can make time to record and edit. The reason I'm inconsistent is because of like the the um what's it called? The like techie side of things as far as like my battery always being exhausted or my memory always being full or my my laptop always crashing. Like things like that is the reason I cannot be consistent. When you are limited on time, especially when I was working, like right now I'm on maternity leave, so I have time when my kids are napping. But when you're working, you're trying to provide for your family, you're trying to go home and cook and do all these things. It's really hard for me to do all of that while wanting to upload and film uh, because I then come into these issues that take way too long to fix. Um... And then I'm wasting more time trying to get my computer to upload images or film, things like that. So I spend way too much time on um, things that don't bring me joy. I'm going to hope that things work out this time around so that I can be as consistent as possible. I hate myself every time I look back at my YouTube channel and see all my inconsistency. So with that being said, let's go ahead and recap on what's been going on the last six months. Um, taking us back to pretty much August when my son turned one. My son turned one August 11th. Um, I started my first official year of teaching. I did start teaching the prior year, but um, it was at the end of the school year. So I started my first official school year where we're back on campus. I have my classroom um, set up and I'm teaching six, sixth grade. Um, pretty much the first week of school. I find out I am pregnant with my second child um, and then ended up on bed rest for an entire month. So from the end of August to the end of September, I was resting at home on bed rest with my son. The holiday season came, September, October, November, all the fun things happened. What else happens? Oh, towards the end of the year, I realized that for a New Year's like resolution type of thing, I wanted to actually pull back from social media. Um, not only does social media suck so much time out of our lives and our day, but I was just finding myself feeling very negative toward social media. Like I would, not with like comparing or anything, but with just like realizing that the people I have on my social media are not people that really care much about me or my life so why am i sharing it with those people and instead of going through and just deleting all these people and causing all this chaos i just told myself you know what starting 2022 i'm actually just going to completely remove myself from social media and all i had up until literally a couple weeks ago all i had as far as social media was youtube and that was because i love watching youtube videos i don't find any any difficulties there so, I didn't have Instagram, didn't have Twitter, don't have Snapchat. Um, the only thing I have now, as of recently, five months into the year, is Instagram. And that's only because I work 
I um, upload on my kids' Instagram account, and my accounts, it's easy to just have all your accounts linked, and you can just flip through all your accounts. So I have my teacher account, my personal account, and then my kids' accounts. And that's the only reason I recently started getting on um, Instagram again. And that's also part of the reason why I just kind of thought I was giving up completely on YouTube. But I, every time I end up coming back and trying to be consistent, it's always because someone tells me, Oh, what happened to your YouTube videos? Like, I loved watching them, or I liked keeping up with you guys on there. And I always say, like, like I just try. And I set, up myself, I set myself schedules to, like, have content to film. But I find that that makes me very overwhelmed. Like, this time I actually just thought I was for sure done, absolutely done. And if this video doesn't make it to the internet, I'm officially done. Because that means it's not because I didn't have time to film or edit. It's because technology issues. Like, my camera didn't let me upload the files. Or my um, computer wasn't working. Something so stupid. So hopefully you guys see this video sometime this week just to let you guys know on how my maternity 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 leave worked i worked up until the middle of march my due date was april 17th um i worked into the middle pretty much one month away from my due date and then i started my leave um and then i had my daughter april 12th um i would be i will be more than happy to share a birth story with you guys um, I feel like <laughs> my birth stories are outrageous, like crazy, crazy experiences for my birth. Um, but everything happens for a reason, and I believe God gave me this life and this experience to share with others, so that is what I will be doing. I turned 27 back in December, and this should have been a vlog that I didn't even think of vlogging, I don't think. But for my birthday, we took a trip to San Diego. And I went to SeaWorld. I mainly went to SeaWorld for my son, but I do love San Diego, and I thought it would have been fun. So we went, spent the weekend there, and I ended up becoming engaged that weekend. Um, Pedro proposed in San Diego, and if you guys didn't know, if you don't, haven't been keeping up with my channel, you wouldn't know our anniversary is in March. So we actually... Since we knew we weren't going to have a big wedding, it's nothing. that's just something we didn't want. Um, we chose to go ahead and get married for our ninth year anniversary. So, March, um, in March, we actually got married. And so, exciting things did happen during my time away. I just missed out on documenting those memories because I'm a dodo head. And I don't have money to buy a new camera or buy a new laptop all of that stuff so i have to do with what i have what i have is not cutting it as far as work um like i said i'm on maternity leave i will be returning back to work in august sadly my daughter will be four months old and my son will be already two so we will have to figure out what's going to happen there but i really don't want to Get back to work just yet so i'm really soaking in and enjoying these months with my kids luckily i am a teacher and so when my maternity leave ends it's already the end of the school year and so i would be on summer vacation so that is that oh some things i actually want to chat about in future videos um revolves around like my spirituality um, and kind of how God has been moving in my life and what my life has been looking like. Um, as a mom of two, as a new wife, as a new wife, as a wife, as a teacher, like kind of every aspect of my life. I kind of want to take you guys on this journey with me and kind of share with you guys how God works in, in me, with me, all of that good stuff. And, um... We shall see how that goes. So if you're wondering why I'm getting ready, um, my kids wake up typically around 1. So I have about 30-ish minutes still before they wake up. Um, I'm going to prepare my son's lunch. He's going to eat. And then I'm actually going to take him out. We're probably going to go out to like, Target. I want to pick up a few things. 
and just to get out the house. Um, when you're home with your kids all day long, it's important for me to get out. And so most of my content coming up will be about motherhood, um, recovering or my postpartum experience, my breastfeeding experience, a lot of motherly, um, like motherhood videos. But I also want to incorporate, like I said, my spirituality into my videos um, along with vlogs, just like family vlogs. So I hope you guys are excited to see a new video from me. Um, if you've never seen any of my videos, make sure you go back and check out a few. I have privated most of them, but there were some that I really wanted to keep public, so I went ahead and republished re not uploaded them but I up I unlock I public I how do I say this? I opened them I opened them. I made them public and so hopefully you guys can go back and look at some of those videos. Subscribe if you would like and thank you guys so much for watching this video. I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.